Rural. Quit trying to start something, you not. Yeah. Rural. Rural. Hey. Yeah. Hey, what's your favorite Garden State moment? Uh, the part when Natalie Portman is just like, hey, you got to hear this one song. And it's just Bruce Springsteen. Oh, he's got the headphones oh. in. Whoa! First Whoa. person. Whoa. First person Garden State. I he, felt like I was Zach Graff. POV Natalie Portman Dude, video. My dream come true. Dude, was that the fucking shins? That was awesome. Wow. No, it's, it's Bruce Springsteen. It's because right. Garden State. Oh, okay. Yeah, this calls off oh. way better. Uh, better start than the last one. Yeah, yeah. this guy's like yeah. a better version of Zach Braff. Yeah. yeah. You're like Zach Braff minus Yugna. You're yeah. like Beard Braff. You're yeah. Zach Beard. Yeah. <laughs> anyway, uh, so do you guys have like a movie that's like really shitty, but it has like sentimental value? Or like Dark a game shit. or something? <laughs> <laughs> sentimental. It's shitty, but sentimental value. You'll, yeah. yeah. I have an I, I'm so, I don't know what, what it is. Kevin? I'm so bad at like. I say it every time, but no, go ahead. No, I'm so bad at on the spot because I know I do, and then right now I'm like struggling. I've said this. Actually. I've said this multiple times on the podcast, but I love the movie Short Circuit too. <laughs> <I love laughs> it, it's not a good movie. Hey, hey, the Super Mario Brothers movie is that, a piece of shit. Oh, yeah. But man, with if that's on, that is staying on. That that movie is that movie is a turgid yeah piece. On air, on air, on air. Yeah, on air. If it, I don't I've still own never it. Seen, I've never I seen don't it. own it. I'll never own it. But if, if it's, it's on, on TV, I'll watch it. Yeah. Put it in face off. Face off. Night's Tale. Or Broken Arrow. Those are two. Dominic, <laughs> Dominic, like, can't believe I haven't seen Face Off. He's like, you're kidding. You have to make time to see Face Off. <laughs> you don't. You don't. No, you don't. You don't. No, you don't. <laughs> but that's his favorite movie like that, though. Oh. Like, I mean, of that you, kind. You, you know what? Honestly, like, you would like it because it's so fucking. Yeah. That's why he said, he's like, Rocco, I've known you your whole life. You will. Yeah. You will die when I mean, you watch thing, face, it's face Off. Them switching faces. Yeah. That's yeah. the movie. Yeah. He takes I mean, his face off. <laughs> oh, that's why they needed that. Uh, it's my favorite uh, part of the movie. I, I, I thought I had been trading faces, but I'm an idiot. I thought it was called Face Swapper. Yep. I'm trying to think of guilty pleasure movies. All the like early trauma movies, uh, yes. Toxic Avenger and uh, Class of Newcomb High. Oh, yeah. uh, I watch like when I, we, I discovered those movies with my friend Spencer and Connor. We watched like all of them until they started getting really shitty. But those, those just those until? two. <laughs> yeah, just the first. No, no, they're <laughs> shitty but good. But then after that, they're just bad. But like Toxic Avenger, seeing that movie for the very first time like blew my mind because it was like, it was bad but still genuinely really funny. So I, I don't know that movie. It was all on Netflix, I think. Yeah. Yeah. Really, but I didn't know. Don't that. like Toxic Avenger, Class of Newcomb High, Toxic Avenger Four. Those are like good. Everything else is whatever. They just came out with the Return to Class of Newcomb High. It just came out hmm. and it's not bad. Like it's it's our. I mean, really? for a trauma movie, like it's it's full trauma, but like it's it's okay. But yeah, original Toxic Avenger and Class of Newcomb High is great. Hmm. What about you? Uh, well, I kind of just meant like a shitty movie, but like like something sentimental about it. Like like the first movie I saw with like like. The I saw on a date with my first date ever oh, okay. was um oh what's it fucking called paranormal activity. See, <laughs> so you have sentimental value. Yeah, but I, I I guess I guess more along the lines of what you were going with Garden State. He he hung up. I don't know. <laughs> Correct, Thanks. Correct well, that code. <laughs> by that criteria, I would have to say Nick and Nora's Infinite Playlist. <laughs> That Do movie, you know. I would never watch again other than to relive my one wild night yeah. where I watched it. <laughs> hey, say, yeah. My one wild night. Same with Pinocchio, Italian Oh, Pinocchio. that's the Italian, one. Yeah. Italian, Pinocchio. Italian Pinocchio. The worst movie, and I don't want it. And you know what's funny? It When it finally came out on DVD, I bought it and had it in my room for like two weeks and went, <laughs> You don't want to watch it this again. Is, this will never replicate what I hope to. And yeah, and I took it back. <laughs> that was it. Keaton.